All right, now before we start today's video off, I'm telling you that I am starting a brand new merch store, so make sure you do check them out. The links will be down below in the description. Now we do got some masks, some phone covers, some hoodies, shirts, mugs, stickers, and all that. So yeah, make sure you do check them out. The links will be down below in the description. Let's go ahead and get straight to this GTA 5 video. Alrighty guys, now in today's GTA 5 online video, I'll be showing you a brand new glitch on how to use any kind of gun or throwable that you want in an RC Bandito, which means you'll be off the radar in an RC Bandito while shooting people inside the car. Now, before we start today's video off, I'm telling you that if you guys aren't new, make sure you do subscribe for more daily GTA 5 online glitches after there is a patch, 1.53, and if you do enjoy today's video, make sure you guys hit that like button as well. Let's go ahead and get straight to this GTA 5 online glitch on how to use your weapons inside your RC Bandito. Alright, so the first thing you guys want to do is just go ahead and make your way to the telescopes at the pier. So I'll go ahead and put a destination marker on where I'm at. So as you're going to see, just go ahead and make your way here. Now obviously you will need the RC Bandito in order to just glitch. So let's go ahead and pull that out. So go to interaction menu. Go to inventory. And request the RC Bandito. Alright, now as soon as you spawn in with the RC Bandito, what you want to do is just go ahead and make your way over here to this wooden square right here near the pier. Now it should have two telescopes, one right here and one right over here. Now the reason why we're getting on this is now we can access the interaction menu. So as you guys see, I can use vehicle services, register as a CEO, motorcycle club, whatever I want to. Now as soon as we completed that step, we're going to make our way over here to this parking lot and we're going to go next to these pedestrians so from here on out what you want to do let's go ahead swipe right on d-pad do not touch it or click it we're just going to swipe right on it and it should change our throwable or our gun whatever we're using as you guys see so like i said i'm going to swipe my finger right across it right and it should change whatever weapon you want it to be so i'm gonna go ahead and get myself the ap pistol And now, all we're going to do is go ahead and go to Interaction Menu. Hold down on D-Pad the whole time you want to shoot somebody, by the way. And you're going to hold L1 and hit R1. And as you guys see, you can shoot anybody that you want to with your gun. As you guys see, I shot him with the AP pistol. So we're going to go ahead, drive. You can let go down on D-Pad, and we're going to find someone else to shoot. But every time you want to shoot somebody, you're going to have to hit down d-pad so let's go ahead and try right here hold down d-pad hit l1 r1 shoot hold down d-pad l1 r1 shoot so pretty much every time you guys shoot somebody by the way you are completely off the radar so they will not recognize that you are coming to shoot them with an rc bandito and you can also throw some explosives at them too if you wanted to but yeah so that's how you use your weapons in the RC Bandito after the recent patch, 1.53. And I hope you guys liked today's video. This has been your boy Froggy, back at another GTA 5 glitch to help you guys out. And I'm out. Peace.